when you're thinking about how to, to add color and how to add expression color and widen your palette, using the contrapassoon is a beautiful color. It's a beautiful tone, that bloom, bloom, and that bloom. That's being able to paint with many more pixels and richness within the pixels and depth of field and color variations of having bright gold against purple. And if you look at a color wheel, which I keep a color wheel in my, in my writing area for music, is that like green, the opposite of green is purple. The opposite of red is what? Uh, is it yellow? The opposite, green. The opposite green. of green is red. Okay. But the, op the complementary opposite yeah, is purple. Right, and you can see what they are. So like, sometimes if you gave everybody red, red, it cancels out. They're just red, unless that's your mood you want. But you put red, and then all of a sudden there's a yellow. Then the eye is drawn to the yellow. So everyone says when they listen to Ravel, they go, man, you know what I really like about Ravel is it's so rich, and I love the colors. And that first piece we listened to this morning, I think what was appealing was that you could hear the colors as that person orchestrated. They painted with colors. They say, I want orange here. That's a blue moment. That's, they painted with colors rather than everything being gray. So if, if you want a big tip is color is a, is a big appealing thing. I mean, it can certainly be diarrhea too. I mean, very much, too much color is silly, too. But just know that you have a complete palette of an orchestra. And, it, and it, you can do very satisfying, expressive things with color. <laughs>